Hi, Greg Parsley, Superintendent of the Vincent's Community School Corporation. We recognize and realize that the major aspect of what we do in the VCSC each and every day is to provide an education, but we also recognize and realize that there are many extensions that we have within the school corporation. And one of those major extensions is the food service program that we provide to our students. We know uh, with the entire COVID-19 that food service, at least at the present time has been interrupted, but we also recognize and realize with our spring break being held this present week, the food service was not going to take place. That has allowed us to get our food service program up and running so that as we go into this period of interruption beginning this coming Monday, March 23rd, we will operate food service at five sites. That includes Tecumseh Harrison Elementary, Vigo Elementary, Riley Elementary, the Washington School, and also Lincoln High School. It will be a curbside program and with that, a grab and go. Now, some unique aspects of the program will be that we'll operate during the hours of, on Monday from 9 a.m. until 11 a.m. Folks will come to any one of those sites and we have videos prepared as to exactly where you will go. You will pull up and you will actually be given meals for the entire week. That includes breakfast and lunch. We're doing it all at once so that we can cut down on folks making trips and including that we are uh, also adding breakfast uh, to the component. The folks would not have to make multiple trips to the school on the same day. With that curbside program or the grab and go, you'll pull up, open your trunk, car door, whatever the case, our food service uh, folks, in addition to other volunteers, will load the food for how many ever kids that you have within the family. The state guidelines are anyone under the age of 18, and we will provide those meals for the entire week. We will do that program again on Monday, March 30th, and then and if we are in a time of uncertainty at the present. If we need to extend this program, we are certainly prepared to do so. When you come to any one of those locations and it does not make any difference, you may have a Clark Middle School student, you may choose to go to Tecumseh Harrison or a Tecumseh Harrison person may choose to come out to Lincoln High School. It makes no difference. Our goal is very simple. We want to be sure that we are keeping students fed. I certainly want to thank our partner of Sodexo uh, in allowing this. I think this is uh, a situation where economies of scale they are a large corporation and they have already begun to enact this program in other places. Uh, we were able to spend this week preparing our plan and, and working alongside with them. I wish we didn't have to provide this program. It's a modified version of the summer feed program that we already do, but the key thing is, is that we are going to keep our folks, our students fed. We also will uh, have an option for folks because we realize not everyone may be able to come out on Monday during those hours of 9 to 11. We also have, as we will need consent, but we will have a form in which you can complete. If you do not have transportation or you have to work uh, and cannot come out, and we will actually deliver um, those items to your house, but as I made mention, Per state guidelines, we must have consent. So we have several different options, but in the end, it comes down to being sure students are kept fed, and that's our intent and goal and what we will do within the Vincent's Community School Corporation. Hope you continue to be safe. You know from our end that we will continue to communicate as many messages as we certainly need to communicate. We will also, uh, and you will be provided information if you do need food delivered to your house through the VCSC helpline or the telephone number and all of those things will be included. Thanks.